Pneumatic testing 1. Work permit obtained to carry out pressure testing 2. Risk assessment available on site 3. Supported documents such as PID and isometric drawing are available and conform to as built facilities at the field 4. Inspection of third party certificate had been carried with valid expiration and coming from approved third party certified company for example manifold PG PSV hose compressor others 5 pressure test safety alert has been distributed to all relevant divisions sections sufficiently in advance 6 pressure measurement tools are calibrated and their statuses of calibration are still valid 7 Pressure gauges used in the test have enough capacity. The gauges are recommended to have 150% of the maximum allowable working pressure, and for the PSV, shall have I 10% of the maximum allowable worming pressure. 8. Pressure gauges are installed at a proper location so that it can be easily read and do not create additional hazards to the pneumatic test or expose personnel to the vessel being tested. 9. Vents are available and installed the high points to vent her. Check the vent line before testing and made sure it is not blocked. 10. Safety relief valve is calibrated. 11. All hoses secured and away from testing crews. 12. No person who does not have any relation with the test, present. 13. Has the manifold has proper shielding to protect testing crew and workers. 14. All the temporary tools, such as valve, fittings, hoses, flanges, blind plate, etc., are rated more than the maximum pressure arid approved by, BMC, company, 15. Its proper resting shelter has been established away from the safe distance of pressure testing, 16. Is access has been established on the package to properly inspect, snooping test, 17. One's elevated package has a working platform to access the joints that needs to be inspected. 18. Is testing crews has a head torch and hand torch wearing high vest, orange, for night work activity. 9. 19. One's proper illumination has been established. 20. Is proper isolation of testing area safe distance has proper established and properly coordinated with the adjacent company, subcontractors. Activities 21. Is Master Harbour has been informed in advance to control vessels and boats in the vicinity of testing area 22. Is proper welfare has been established to the testing Hydrostatic testing 1. Work permit obtained to carry out pressure testing 2. Risk assessment available on site 3. Supported documents such as PID and isometric drawing are available and conform to as built facilities at the field. 4. Inspection of third party certificate had been carried with valid expiration and coming from approved third party certified company, for example, manifold, PG, PSV, hose, compressor, others 5. Pressure test safety alert has been distributed to all relevant divisions sections sufficiently in advance 6 pressure gauges used in the test have enough capacity the gauges are recommended to have 150 percent of the maximum allowable working pressure and for the psv shall have 110 percent of the maximum allowable working pressure 7 pressure measurement tools are calibrated and their statuses of calibration are still valid 8 Pressure gauges are installed at a proper location on so that two can be easily read and do not create additional hazards to the hydrostatic test or expose personnel to the vessel being tested. 9. Equipment and pipelines that do not include in the hydrostatic test are isolated. 10. Safety relief valve is calibrated. 11. All hoses secured and away from testing crews. 12. No person who does not have any relation with the test present 13 the hydrostatic pressurizing pump is provided with safety relief valve 14 all personnel involved are wearing the ppe required as per work permit 15 appropriate procedures are in place for treatment and disposal of hydro test water 16 do not monitor during pressurization step directly from the front of sight glass or level glass 17 
Do not use 90 degree nozzle for blowing down pressure or can twist off and turn it into a lethal projectile. 45 degrees are better, but the safest blow down is straight up. Please give comment and suggestions. Thank you. Subscribe our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. Thank for visit our channel. See you next class. Thank you.